Hello people, Drifter King here, and welcome to another Survival Sunday, and we're back here with uh, the Skyblock. I have been hard at work just getting cobblestone, really, nothing else. That's all I've been doing, got some stacks of cobblestone here, all useful stuff. Actually, I need this bucket. So, we we just, yeah, did that off camera like I said would. Apparently this, just having a block above the source of the water will stop it freezing when it's snowing, so... That should be good for the snow, but it still just freezes in general when it feels like it, but it's a bit better anyway. And the thing we want to be doing is making an infinite water source. So we put this ice here, break it, it becomes water, and we take this water and put it down in here. And it becomes infinite water. Voila! So we can place this back in here. Yeah, excellent. Infinite water isn't square off anymore. I find it weird. You can see the dips in the corners. It's not perfectly level. I guess water in general wouldn't be perfectly level anyway, so... It's all good, it's all good. I've noticed that I've put this over some of my precious, precious grass though, which is... not very well good. Uh, it doesn't matter anyway, because what I'm about to do today will allow me to actually knock this grass out and not care. What I need is this water first and then we need to do something rather dangerous. That This might get me killed. Don't want to lose my melons. Uh, we can do this with just... Can we do it with just half a stack for now? No, we'll just take the entire stack. I'm gonna put this bit of water here and it'll drip over the edge and I'm gonna very very whoop scared very scared very very carefully place some stone here which will then allow me to oh crap build underneath it's not the best thing in the world, but it's now doable. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Come on. Let me up. I want to get up now. I just want to get out of here. And we can. T oh, god damn it. See, this not very useful. I need to do it where it's not in the snow biome, but everywhere around here is the freaking snow. It even crosses the Frickin' bridge. Uh, there was an option uh, for downloading a map that isn't in a snow biome, but then making the snow golems would be an impossible task, so I don't know why anybody would do that one. Right, take this up and uh, just place it in there. Why the hell not? Right, so we can actually build down there now. It's not exactly the best thing in the world, but we can do it. So I can take my other bits of stone and stuff. Leave my bucket in there because I do not want to lose that. That's all my snow. Yes, that's all good. Yes, quite, quite. Which side was it on? It's here. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Ow. Well, that went weird. Why did that go so weird? The water still not quite hit the bottom of the world yet. Do this. And we'll have a second layer to our place. And it means we can take this dirt up if we want as well. And move it around without losing it. Because we don't want to lose dirt because it's actually pretty darn important. Right, I will expand this a bit this way as well. This is all very, very dangerous. I don't know why I brought my pick... Oh, in case I did a mistake. That's why I brought my pick with me. Well done there, Jeff. Don't you feel special? You have no idea how hard I am holding the shift key in right now. I'm surprised I haven't broken the bugger yet. It's like, no! Do not want to die. Yes, okay, you're dripping. I get it. God. I seem to have a bit of 
uh, lag spike problems with this world. I've had a few worlds that it's affected, but not all of my worlds it's affected. It's like I did a little video on a awesome jungle seed I found. It's unlisted, so no one can find it, but I sent that into Minecraft.net. It's not up yet because I accidentally put it as private at first, so I. They take a while to get back to you, and they got back to me saying uh, it's private, so I had to send it off, uh, send unlist it, and then send it off again, which was kind of annoying. But yeah, uh, that had no lag whatsoever, and a f creative world that I found some place I wanted to build something cool looking on, that had no lag. But it's not lag. It's like it's not like it's just lagging. It's just constant little lag spikes and it's it's really annoying it's all I can say I should really build this staircase up before I run out of cobblestone we'll do that now yes I know I'm being a bit too careful but I don't care you be on a map where you can just die from a stupid mistake and not be careful on it Ah. See, sir, we oh, get screwed. It's a shame I can't make an enchanting table. Is there any way to get diamonds on this goddamn map? I, I very much doubt it. Oh, we have melon, we have pumpkin. What the hell will I do with pumpkins? Honestly. Ooh, snow golems, that's what I need pumpkins for. Duh. What do I need grass for? This is what I'm curious about. What is actually the use for grass? I know there is one, but I can't remember all the challenges, but oh well. I wish there was some way to get more dirt, to be honest. Because the dirt that we have at the moment isn't the most useful amount in the world. What is that dirt underneath of? Is that just randomly there? Can that actually get taken up? No, we'll not do it yet. We'll expand further first, then we'll try that. We want to actually have this go underneath everywhere up there. It's like it's like a safety net is what this is going to be. And this will be where I build most of my stuff on. Whereas that will be all farms and crap. And probably my house as well will be up there because this isn't tall enough to have a house on it. But whatever. Who cares? This is so unbelievably risky. Don't think it's anywhere near as risky as the waterfall thing, though. That was just ridiculously nerve wracking. So, oh god, oh god, oh god. Well, that's all that's going through my head at the moment, as well, to be honest. But once we get this done, we get things moving. What I have realised, though, is I need to get coal. I need some torches down there before it <laughs> allows stuff to spawn. No, no, this will do. For now. I should get some more cobble while I'm here, though. Hmm, cobblestone. Eh, yeah, look, all my cobble's about to run out again, which means I'll have to get more again. Oh yeah, this should keep it from freezing over, shouldn't it? Pretty sure torches keep water from freezing, don't they? means I should place some up here too. Like so. Uh, hopefully that'll work. So before it becomes night time we'll place torches all around here. See you can see the lag spikes are just going nope no frames per second for you. Nope. Can't have that. Uh, no. Don't want them to be directly on the edge. It's like if I press F3, it's like, yeah, my runner's computer's running exactly how it used to, but then I move, lag spike, lag spike, lag spike, lag spike, lag spike. Look at them all. Look at those little red lines that just dip out there. That's what this update has done to my computer. Like I say, though, it's not all maps. If it was all maps, I'd be like, right, well, my computer's obviously just not good enough for the increased world size, but it's not. It's not all maps. And it's not all the time either. Mm. 
That's great, just put it all in there. I do have some wood left, don't I? No, no, I don't. Do not want to use all my wood. That would be very silly, Jeff. Although I do have a tree there waiting to just grow. It's like hurry up already. Down here I go. Right, can I take this dirt then? This dirt does seem to be accessible. Right, cool. I will expand this like two more in both directions. And that should be okay. It's not really going under my portal or my bridge yet, but who cares. The bridge goes to nowhere at the moment, so that's not exactly important. And it's only a freaking never portal. It's not like it's, you know, gonna get destroyed by a creeper blast or anything, is it? God, how awful would it be if obsidian could get destroyed by creeper blasts? That'd make this map near on impossible. Really would. Okay, I think we can be a bit less cautious right now. For this bit, anyway. And then we go here. The lag spikes aren't helping my comfortableness. Comfortableness? I don't know. Is that even? A, that's not a word. I know that's not a word, but I don't know what the hell else I'd say instead. Hmm. How would you say that? Oh well, it's not helping that whatsoever. Right. See, now we have an infant water source. We can actually make a farm that isn't right next to my bloody cobblestone generator. Um. Which should probably, it should be around here, but they don't want to use up even more freaking grass. Although the grass will spread anyway, what are you on about, Jeff? I can get this grass up and replace this with cobble. Well, this bits of dirt here, I'll do that from underneath though. And... Not quite, yeah, I need to put dirt up and plant some crap. That's exactly what I need to do. I'm a very descriptive person, in case you haven't been able to tell. Ooh, thought I was going to lose that then. I was about to say, where the hell's my actual stuff? I'm about to say, I don't think I picked that one up. Okay, whoop. There we go. We don't want to be using it. We want to place stuff around. Like so. And then that stuff is done. And then we can use the dirt that we picked up to make a better farm than the crap thing we currently have. Ooh, a tree. Did I make an axe? I did. Good Jeff. Why are my trees always tiny though? I want a big tree. You know, actually give me a decent amount of stuff would be nice. I want more dirt than what I have. It's not enough. It's just not enough. Okay, leaves, go away. You're getting in my way here. Ooh, an apple. Excellent. We like apples. need to think just exactly how much grass I can get rid of and how much I need to keep. I say if I had like this area still as grass it means I have the ability to expand further so we can do this which means the dirt underneath this can also be taken up so just the dirt around the bedrock cannot be touched. See we had some kind of plan. Okay so those aren't lighting up but that one is uh, freezing over should I say. So we do that and then that should actually stay. Hopefully. It's the plan anyway. That one hasn't frozen over again. 
So it seems to work. Hmm. Where am I actually going to put the water? Guess it can go down here, can't it? It's just a stream. Like so. And like so. What do you guys think? This this is a better farm? I think it's a better farm. There's that cactus there. Don't know where I'm going to plant trees now though. I guess I can go there. Can it? That won't ruin anything with it. I need more torches because all this water here is going to freeze over. That's a bugger. So the water doesn't affect the grass underneath, so this will it'll stay as grass, so that's okay. I don't actually have normal seeds though, do I? Not yet, no I don't. Um. We can get the sugar cane going though. I need my hoe. That's what I need. I'm trying to think then. What the hell do I need, Jeff? Uh, bucket. Wood going here. Take water. Use the water. Like so. I'm making this area all inconvenient, I Far more than it needs to be. Not fought any of this crap through. Ow! Stupid cactus. And now it's freezing over already. Bloody typical. Uh, we can make torches from this crap though. 32 torches. Excellent. And then we can completely frame this with torches and nothing should freeze over. It's the plan anyway. Voila! We have a lot of torches <laughs> around there. We need some kind of clear pathway to here so I can get down properly. Not quite there, so I can't just drop down there like I was about to. That would have ended badly. I don't need the hoe yet because I don't have proper seeds. Can't get proper seeds until I make my mob trap. Can't make my mob trap until I get more cobblestone. Isn't this all a predicament? I do want to move my melon and pumpkin farm because it's not exactly convenient there, is it? But I don't know where to. Guess it could go here. That would still fertilize it, wouldn't it? Yes, it would. We will make it here. Hold shift. We're slowly making progress, aren't we, guys? It's not bad, it's not bad. Uh. Steady. Steady. Don't want to die. And then we could 
take this on over this way. Don't know why, but we can. This will eventually fruitate from this ugly, rotten bit of plant life into an amazing piece of art slash flower thing. I don't know. What the hell I'm trying to say. So, <laughs> God knows if you're going to know what the hell that was all about. It's going to fruitate into something beautiful and fabulous. Fabulous. Hmm. We need to take this crap and move it. I'll have my melons first though. Tar. And my pumpkin. Huh. Can give you up to three seeds from those mature ones. That's pretty cool. And then we need the dirt. The dirt is definitely vital. It's all grass again. Oh, look at that. It's beautiful. It's beautiful, man. Beautiful. Like that. That will do, will it not? I can take some of these melons and get a couple more seeds. I think three of each should do. I can take my stone hoe now and till all this. One, two, three. One, two, three. Uh. Screw it. Melons are more important anyway, so that's four and four. So those will grow. They only have one place to grow out to though. It's not the most productive farm in the world, we'll be honest. But it's better than the pile of crap we had a minute ago. Uh, that's two. This wants to be another one out here. Also makes it safer. I don't like walking over one pathway is over a sheer drop to death. It's never really a good idea to do that. Let's face it. I should actually do this one more out and then make like a frame so uh, like this it's easier to just show people. And then I won't drop to my doom. Hopefully. And then we can continue that round. Although I don't need to do the bit underneath anymore. I'll just use this. Why am I being so careful? I mean, honestly. I'm not even near the edge. Jesus, Jeff, what the hell are you on? Okay, I don't have any cobble left, do I? Nope. Typical. Whoa! We have a big tree. How did I not even realise that? What the hell, Jeff? Pay attention. Tree growing big like you wanted it to, and you don't even, you know, batter an eyelid. my tree growing spot there. That's what that is. Uh, screw it, one can go there for now. That's just a temporary place. It means I get more than one tree at a time. Though, how much dirt do I have left? None. I used it all. Typical. Oh, there's some under there that I... Might, some under somewhere that I can take, isn't there? I think. Yeah, under this shape here. Thank you. But we're doing good. We're doing good. Got my first pumpkin that I didn't turn into seeds. Uh, 
got more wood. Oh, I forgot I got a second type of sapling. Was that from the Never? I think that was, wasn't it? Ah, see, we're doing good. Can't do anything with the mushrooms till I make a mob spawner either. I'll have to get that done next time. I think I will just leave it here, to be honest. There's not much else I can do. I will be spamming the crap out of this cobblestone generator between episodes again. And I think I will finish off in between episodes underneath here. And... I think that's it really. Let's finish off underneath here. Getting doing that I need a bunch more cobblestone, get a bunch more of after that. All that boring stuff I keep having to do. And yeah, I think that uh, that'll probably do. I might make up here a bit bigger as well. But that's just the stuff to do in between episodes. Basically expanding the island with cobblestone because I think I've done enough expanding on screen now. I think I need to move on to doing other stuff or else the series won't progress very quickly at all now, will it? So, we've made quite a lot of progress so far. I hope you're enjoying this new Skyblock series. Uh, doing things a bit retardedly, so I hope that's different enough to other normal series of Skyblock for it to be a bit different for you. I have cobblestone in here. What the hell, Jeff? What the actual hell? Hold shift. And then you do this. Voila! We have a pathway down to our lower area. Which we will also, like, frame off somehow. like this that, that's F Jeff something like so maybe although that's become free why have I made that free oh well what the hell it can be free uh, Jeff that's uh not where they want to be. Whoop, lost that one. Whoa. Steady on. Steady on, sure. So we do this. Like so. Wahahaha. careful like so there we are we'll just leave it at that for now definitely a lot safer though let's put it that way so, please leave a like, please comment, please subscribe if you haven't already. This is Jeff the King, signing out.